two, three. Good morning. It's currently almost 8 o'clock, so we're gonna leave here pretty soon. It snowed a lot. I'll show you. I don't know if you can see, but it snowed a lot last night, and it's still snowing. I think we're leaving at like 8 30. I'm pretty much all packed and ready to go. So, I guess I should probably explain what this video is going to be. So, I live in Colorado, and we are driving to Oklahoma City in Oklahoma for surgery. I'm getting surgery on my neck. So, we split up the driving into like a couple days. It's Tuesday today. I'm bringing Finnegan, and we are gonna kind of take it as like a training opportunity. I have a nine month old standard poodle service dog in training. So, pretty much, it's just gonna be his first time in a hospital. So, I'm really nervous about it. I'm just gonna take you guys along with me, and it'll be interesting. We'll see how it goes. I'm just getting surgery on my neck. I have this like like a lump. It's like reoccurring. I got surgery last year to remove it and it came back. They're gonna go in and try and take it out again. I hope you guys enjoy the vlog. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what I'm bringing for Finn really quick. I'm bringing like his vest, a leash strap, his leash, his lamb toy, lots of treats, my bait bag, poop bags, a brush, and pumpkin, his probiotic, his prong for food. I'm just bringing this bag. I'm not sure if you guys have heard, but I've heard some stuff recently like on Instagram and stuff about like the Purina Pro Plan, which is what we feed. And I know a lot of people feed that. There's like something going around that might be contaminated or something, but apparently it's only the newer bag. So this is an older bag. So I think this one's fine. If you know anything about that, you should comment down below because I'm contemplating if I should like switch his food or something. Can y'all hear me good? <laughs> Can you guys hear me good? Um, I don't want to vlog in public. I'll, I'll update you. There's no one around, but I'm gonna update you guys in the hotel room. Okay. <laughs> hey. 
Hi guys, so we're at the hotel now. It's four o'clock. I'm really tired. Finn has a lot of energy though because he's just been sitting in the car and we're just gonna be hanging out. I don't know what we're gonna be doing. We might like walk around the town later and we just did a little training session, like we're tr get, getting his leash. I'll update you when something fun happens. Get your leash. I ate dinner, Finn ate dinner. I'm just taking him out one more time before bed. And then we're leaving the hotel tomorrow at like eight o'clock to get on the road. And then we have like a five hour drive. guys a tour of the airbnb really quickly it's like 3 30 but we just got here we're not gonna do much today since we just got here airbnb tour yay okay so here's the front door crocs <laughs> um and then you just come in and there's a living room um a tv this really cute little plant over here oh and then if you come back like through the living room so this is the kitchen um not really super exciting it's really cute though and there's another plant this one looks kind of dead it's kind of cute though it's so cute and then if you go this way there's his lamb Finn. oh good boy get your lamb um and then there i just have his stuff on this little desk and then if you come back here the two bedrooms right here and then the bathroom and this is my room i just have all my stuff there and like a little closet thing and then what oh. <laughs> good boy and then if you go out this way, this is where my mom's staying. Kind of like the same room. High five. Good job, thank you. Oh yeah. And then, back here is the bathroom. That's the tour. It's very vibrant and fun. I'm just gonna give Finn some water and probably like organize some of my stuff. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hi guys, good morning. It's one, <laughs> I guess not good morning, it's 1.30. And I woke up at like 12.30, so pretty much today we're just gonna hang out. My surgery is tomorrow, so we're waking up like really early to go. So yesterday pretty much what we did was we went to Target and Finn was really good. I'll put some stuff on the screen. And then I showered and then we came back here. We pretty much just hung out. Yesterday we went to the park with Finn like across the street and there was a dog there and they played and it was really cute. They made friends. I'll try and vlog whatever we do today. I don't think we're gonna do a whole lot, but we might like walk around downtown or something. How is your lamp? Good boy. Oh, <laughs> We're 
gonna go to Target soon because I need to get face washed. So we're gonna take Finn in again. It's gonna be a second time at this Target and I'm gonna show you guys his OOTD. This vest is from Petflect and then these patches are from Banks Angel Embroidery on Etsy. It's getting really small on him. So I'm gonna have to get a new one. And then this in training leash wrap from Happy Paws Bandanas. And then a five foot biothane leash from CSJ Creations on Etsy. And then he's wearing his matching red biothane collar, a Herm Springer prong. And then I just have my treat pouch and we're using Zook's treats for training. That's the OOTD. I vlogged was but we went to Target came home I took a shower now I'm just gonna take Finn out one more time and then we're gonna go to sleep and then tomorrow we're waking up and going I have to be at the hospital at like 7 for like pre-op and stuff so I'm just gonna take Finn out and then probably watch Vampire Diaries for a little bit and then go to bed I will see you guys in the morning Hi guys, good morning. It's like 6.20 and, and we're about to leave. That's what's happening. I'm gonna get Finn all dressed and then I have to take him out to potty before we go. What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> later I'm editing this video it's been like a couple weeks <laughs> so I'm pretty much like fully recovered and stuff but I just wanted to come on and like explain something so the next clip you'll see is me after surgery so essentially we got there and then we went inside Finnegan came with obviously so he stayed with my mom and I through pre-op like when I got my IV in and when they were taking my vitals and all of that pre-op stuff they ended up giving me like the sleepy drug a little bit earlier like before I actually went back to surgery Finnegan was just like in a downstate by my mom but like I wasn't like close to him and it just didn't make sense to have him inside the like pre-op room then pretty much my mom just took him with her after I got prepped and had to go back for surgery my mom just took Finnegan with her to the car and then after surgery she didn't bring him in again they literally just wheeled me out to the car so Finnegan was only there like in the hospital actually for like the beginning of pre-op so anyways I'm really sorry that I didn't get like any footage of that but if you guys have any questions about that experience just comment them down below and I couldn't answer them enjoy me being very drugged um i literally don't remember filming this clip hi hi guys i just got out of surgery a little bit ago it's 10 30 now so he really doesn't have a clue what's going on michael you poor sweet thing i'll see you guys in a little bit is that all I should say? Mm -hmm. Okay. Bye. Hi guys. I'm back at the Airbnb now and I'm watching The Bachelor. Um, last time when they did the surgery, I had a drain in, but this time I don't. And my throat is really sore from being intubated. And I just door dashed Panera because I'm supposed to only eat soft foods. I got mac and cheese from Panera, brownie, and a mango smoothie. I'm still really tired from the anesthesia, I think. I'll probably update you guys in a little bit. My voice sounds like I'm a 50-year-old smoker, so that's great. Hi, guys. I just wanted to update you. It kind of hurts to talk, so <laughs> I'm not going to talk a lot. It's now 7.30, so I'm probably going to door dash dinner. I literally just slept from like 2 and then I took a shower so we're leaving tomorrow morning at like 8 and then we're driving like a little more than halfway and then getting a hotel and staying there for a night and then waking up the next morning and finishing the drive I, I'm still falling for you for you
She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Good morning, it's 8.30 and we are leaving the Airbnb now There must be something bad Hi guys, it is now Sunday the 31st. It's 12.30. I know my voice sounds disgusting. Pretty much last night I didn't vlog anything, but after we drove like halfway, we stopped at a hotel and then this morning we woke up at like 8 and left the hotel. Now we're home. Um, so that's gonna be the end of this video. I really wanted to vlog in the hospital, but it was just like a really stressful environment and it was like so much to manage. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you can subscribe to our channel and like this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!